Come, come. Good boy. Oh, there's a tension. There was finally a reason to smile at the Stankovichs today. Against all the odds, 16-year-old Eliza was home. Her faithful mate Ozzy by her side. He knows that there's something wrong. Like, you know, nothing. It's not quite right. And he'll just sit with me. These two haven't been face to face for more than five months. It was in late September when Eliza was rushed to hospital, a victim of meningococcal disease. The teenager lost both legs and all her fingers as doctors battled to save her life. Few patients have ever been so badly infected and survived. But Eliza has now fought all the way home. I mean, just having my own bed and everything, I mean, odd. you can't compare it to a hospital. Eliza is already counting down to the day when she may no longer need her wheelchair. Definitely in the next couple of weeks, I'm going to be learning to walk with, well, stand up at least, with um, air legs. They've got like an air cushion in them. Difficult days lie ahead, but it seems Eliza Stankovic won't be satisfied until she walks through her own front door. Uh, I think it will be pretty fun. Um, it will be really hard, I know that. But I'm looking forward to it. Mark Ferguson, National 9 News.